Hi, I'm Heather Letzi from Findability University, and let's talk about Google. Whether you Google yourself and you see yourself there or not, it's always kind of hard to understand why does Google rank what it ranks, where it ranks on its search results. Well, let me take you back to the beginning. So Larry Page and Sergey Brin were Stanford students. They're finishing up their final work. And they say, you know what? We're frustrated. We're frustrated because all these amazing professors and students are creating this fabulous content. And then at the end of the day, only certain amounts of that content go to the library. What about that big vacuum in between? Well, Larry and Sergey said, we need to close that gap. And that's how Google was born. It was a database of all the content on the Stanford campus that we could find right away. And so let's fast forward to today. You have a website, you're a business owner, you deserve to be findable. What we have to think about is how to make you a thought leader, not a salesman. Google does not want to rank salesmen, they want to rank thought leaders. So if you haven't updated your website in a year, you don't blog, and you're not socially engaged, would you take a class from yourself? Are you really the most current, up-to-date professor in your industry? So think about that. When you're thinking about, am I going to take a look at being truly findable? You're going to have to be committed. You're going to have to have a great website, a blog, and be socially engaged because you are a professor in your space and you deserve to be found.